Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we're reviewing these two Funko Pops here, the Nezuko Komodo Box Lunch Exclusive, and this big boy here, the Devil's Throne from Cuphead. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, starting off here, we got the Devil's Throne here from Cuphead. This is the moment. Let's do that like right there. I'm trying to have it on my background, but my camera can't see it. Is. Okay. So yeah, this is the moment from Cuphead when he's jumping out of his skin into the second phase where you go underground. So yeah, this is the box here. It's a, it's a bit big, but these are the other ones. The Devil's Throne, Aeroplight, Miss Chalice, and Seth Saltmaker. Those are from the Delicious Last Course DLC, so yeah. Uh, let's rip this bad boy open. Yeah, this is a... Yeah, so let's rip him open. Alright, we got him out of the box. Get that box out of here. Uh, let's... Whoa. What was... what was this one? Anyways, oh, this thing is massive. This is like it compared to my hand. Oh, wait, get, get out of here, box. Okay. Um, so, yeah, I mean, this is super cool. Set it up right there, right there. This is a better view. So uh, what you can see here is like a comparison here. You know, looking up like ooh, ooh. Okay. So it's got that down there. Ignore him. He's chilling. He's kind of broken his leg, but back to the so starting off, this is of course his Oh that okay, we're gonna come back to that one. That's a detail right there. I, I can move it. I'm getting way too distracted. Okay. Starting off, we got his obviously iconic red throne with the gold and red color scheme going on here with the like line on the bottom and of course we got the devil final boss i think you can move his head which moves the, his pitchfork and his hands now obviously getting a closer look he's of course gotten his big white horns his yellow and black eyes with the pac-man kind of shape his skeleton is showing as he's about to jump out of it and his hands are obviously opening it and we've then got the furry like the fur kind of i don't know i don't even know what to call this is it fur like i don't know it's just, we're just gonna call it fur the fur the black fur around his like legs and stuff and we got his dogs you know the claw and the thing i noticed earlier is on the back here his tail is coming out the um the like arrow shaped tail is coming out i think i personally think that's a pretty cool detail and yeah this is the Word the, the Devil's Throne pop. On, on, go on to this one. All right, next up here we got the box lunch. <coughs> Excuse me, uh, but next up here we got the box lunch exclusive Nezuko Komodo. Now this is the side, you know, the character blah blah blah. You know you've seen this before. This is the rest of the wave here: Tanjiro, Komodo, Nezuko, Zenitsu, Inosuke, and Muzan. I if you saw. Yeah, you know Skay's there. I have him laying down. Probably gonna do a video with him. Yeah, so. Now, I usually, what I do is I like to keep the exclusives in a box for display. So I'm gonna very carefully open this, so, um, yeah. Yeah, and on the lid here, the Demon Slayer ones, I'm pretty sure, if it's not just them, let me know in the comments, but they have a little quote here. Right, like, does it... If, like, uh, like, Nezuko's is just that, because, you know, she doesn't really speak, but Tanjiro's would be, like, a Rengoku, right? If he had one, it'd probably be, set your heart ablaze. You, you get the point, but back to, you know, opening this thing carefully. Alright. Here it is. Let me... Ugh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Careful there. Okay. Uh, 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 hello? Can, can, can you see us down here? Okay, here is the Nezuko. Now, this is the, um, let's just, we'll talk about what moment it is later, but, um, let's just start with the, um, thing here. This is the, you know, I'm gonna try to light on for this one. This one's kind of dark. Hold on one sec. Okay. Um, <laughs> anyways, back. So, of course, we've got the iconic black hair with the, um, I guess, orangish-reddish kind of strips coming down, the bamboo pacifier, the little purple, or pink, purple, the pink little hair tie. Wait, what is that? Is that like a little... Anyways, thought that was like a pupil, but it wasn't. Of course, got the, like, yeah, lashes, eyebrow. Okay, moving on to the body here. 
She's, of course, got her iconic pink with the checkered thing with the green on top with the uh, black cloak over it running. Now, judging by the sleeves here, this is probably from, or this is not probably, it is from the moment when on the mountain with Rui, the spider family, before they get taken to the Hashiro when she's running from... Oh, sorry, I'm going to put an image on screen of it so you know what it is, because I literally cannot remember her name, but it's one of Shinobu's students who's chasing her because she's a demon before the crow comes in and is like, yo, cut that out. But yeah, this is the box on Jacuzzi, as you go comment. So yeah, this is the review of the Devil from Cuphead and his throne, and the Box Lunch exclusive Nezuko Commodore. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more Funko Pop reviews and gaming content.